Good morning, YouTube. Welcome to another episode of Bonafide. This is episode six of the Office Edition, and today we've got a really exciting episode for you because we've teamed up with Union Wood Co. and they are building an incredible boardroom table for the office. So, you guys are coming along for the entire process. We're gonna talk about design, we're gonna talk about materials, we're gonna talk about how all of these pieces come together, so today is gonna to be a great day. Hey everybody, it's Karen here. If you're new to the channel, well, I'm an interior designer in Vancouver and I've been growing my company, House of Bond, along with my amazing team for over 10 years. What's great about Bonafide is that you get to see the design and construction process behind my personal design projects. These are not for clients, they're my own projects. In this case, we've been busting at the seams, so I just signed a new office lease and we're in the midst of designing our new studio space. We have to be ready to move in six short weeks, so catch all the action in this new series of Bonafide, the office edition. And I have Craig here, the owner of Hi, Union. YouTube. <laughs> Hi, YouTube. Right now, we're in the showroom. We're open to the public every day but Sunday. And it's a great space to, to show people and let them feel the wood and, and see the other products that are made. And then we can always go to the shop and look at the products that were being made right now. Handcrafted furniture. Um, we service the North American market, so but we're really excited to keep this in our own neighborhood. Basically. Totally, and I'm so excited that we finally have a, a proper yeah, boardroom table okay. or in a boardroom room yeah. to start because the old office we did not have a boardroom yeah. and it was like one open space basically like this and you had all of your client meetings, all of the work, all right. the everything in one space. So to be able to shut the door now and actually have like our meetings and clients come in is amazing. Have to be featured in your office is like a dream country. So oh, that's awesome. we're really excited about it. Yeah, well the entire team is like so excited about oh, this table. Oh, yeah. And um, we were double checking measurements and stuff like that yesterday oh, good, when good, we were good. in the office. Perfect. What we settled on, because the boardroom is 16 and a half feet long. Yep by about eight and a half feet wide. So it's a pretty sizable boardroom. We've got an oval top, nine feet long by 38 feet wide. Yep. You guys have selected our radius table. So, so this is very similar to the design. Yeah, this is how, how you were started, right? You guys have a product offering. Yeah, we have a product. But you also do custom. Yeah, so our products are highly customizable. Like we make everything to order, so we don't stock, you know, 50 of these radius tables at all. They're all made specific to the client's needs and uh, specific requirements. Um, we do have a product listing, so it shows various sizes, but that's really just to kind of um, get the ball rolling mm -hmm. and, and uh, plant some ideas in your head of what's possible. Yeah. But, but you guys have gone with a, a lighter wood for an oak on the top. I love that the table has so much presence too. For furniture, we always want to work with, um, whenever possible, we want to work with hardwoods. So mm -hmm. oak and walnut and ash. I never really thought about it in that context, but with furniture, yeah. you don't want it to scratch and dent and all that stuff as much, and so yeah. that's why you're using hardwood. As you're going with the natural oak, which is really nice, it has called fleck in it. Yeah. But it's a oh, it's kind of an imperfection in the grain that's unique to oak. This is a whitewashed version of that same material. When we put the clear coat in it, we add a tiny bit of white to change the color tone. You have these natural imperfections, yeah. which are actually the beautiful Absolutely. parts of Absolutely. the material. Absolutely, that's the best part. 
So it's got a, a, a premium North American hardwood top, mm -hmm. uh, all finished with a commercial grade lacquer, so you can spill your coffee and wine and stuff on it, and that's not a problem. Which we do from time to time. Which is potentially an <laughs> um, There's like a steel skeleton that's underneath that, and then it's held up by a solid wood, and then it's wrapped with the tambour. This is called tambour. Yeah, so tambour is created basically of um, usually solid wood, and okay. we actually um, manufacture it in a sheet like this. So it, cool. it's really cool. I love that you see the texture, and I love that there's actually some pieces that kind of pop out that are quite a bit lighter. Yeah. The oxidized finish that, that you guys go with definitely gives it a little bit more depth. So that's what the finished piece is gonna look like. Beautiful. This is still the working version of it. I see the top comes in two pieces. Yeah. And then the base. The whole thing will actually come in four pieces. So okay. So the base um, goes together on site and the top goes together on site. And we always do that because what if your business has to move or grow or change? Totally. And you want to be able to take that investment piece with you, right? Yeah. You know, after 10 years, we have uh, kind of found a little wedge in the North American market. Um, so, so you guys will ship to the States? Yeah, like cool. probably 70% of our items are shipping to the States now. Wow. Well, that's good to know because for those of you guys who are in the States, we have lots of American friends. Uh, unionwoodco.com? Yeah, unionwoodco.com. We ship all over North America every day. So, um, lots of our products are large, but they can always be uh, made uh, into smaller pieces so they fit in elevators and crates and can be shipped easily. So, we have our businesses are the same age. So nice! On That's awesome! Yeah. I love it! So, when you're making a tabletop, yeah. Like, would that be out of something like this? Or how no, this, this is what table. This is how tabletops are made. So no this way. keeps them the most stable. So occasionally, it's been popular in the last few years that people want a slab. The issue with that, and it's something that we can address because it's a one big piece. It doesn't um, dry evenly, right. so it tends to want to crack. It's a clear epoxy, um, and we use it on knots and cracks. It, these are actually little areas where um, there's sap in the grain. This is how the wood comes to us. So it's a, a rough board, um, and they cut it to only a certain width okay, when it's being milled, okay. um, so that it doesn't um, crack or check. When we uh, make a tabletop, the best way to do it is to take these boards, make it straight on either side, and then we glue them together to make your whole top. And the next time you see it, it's going to be in a finished product. Amazing. Hi. Well, it's going to be ready in about three weeks, which is awesome. They can take the oak, and instead of doing a natural finish, they can whitewash it and lighten it up, which is great. Which is one of their colors. Opinions. Opinions? Opinions. What do you think? Yeah, I do like the walnut though. I don't mind the walnut at all. Do we want to try to change the top? To white? I don't think white. I don't think white top. I like the walnut. You like the walnut? Yeah. Maybe the lighting just needs to change in here. It's I a dark it's room. The lighting. I don't think it's good. It's good. Yeah? It looks designery. 
It does look designery, right? Yeah. I still want to do the chandelier. It would look really good with the so light. Nice. Okay. We're getting there, you guys. One room is almost done. Okay, good. We're happy with it then. Yay! Yay! Yay. Okay, good. <laughs> I'll be back. glam and power. I feel like though that's the one space that could be really glamorous and everywhere like any this is artsy and creative. So we know what our number one option is then. Yeah. It's the end of the day and I'm standing in the boardroom. I'm really excited about the boardroom table that's coming from Union. Let me know what you guys think of the boardroom table. Make sure you leave a comment below. Let me know if you like the oxidized black base with the natural wood top or whether you'd actually prefer the whitewashed wood top. So that would be great to know from you guys. Thanks so much for watching and until next time, I'll see you in the next video. We're gonna bang out about four more looks in the next three hours. Get them all. Yeah, perfect. Let's see how it works.